Deep in the heart of Borneo, the Murum River drains a vast area of over 2,700 square kilometers. Sarawak Energy has harnessed this sustainable, renewable energy source as part of Sarawak's transformation into a fully developed state. The Murum Hydroelectric Plant was developed as an integral part of Sarawak government's SCORE strategy to raise incomes and lifestyles to developed state standards by 2030. Murum is Sarawak Energy's first hydropower project for the last 30 years. Murum is an important milestone in the transformation of Sarawak Energy from a traditional utility to a modern, agile corporation. The Murum project was delivered successfully with a strong cooperation with our contractors, especially Three Gorges, consultants, government bodies, and most importantly, the people of the Murum community. Thank you, Peremi Kasi, Sisini, Sayo Tenet, Tusen Tak, to everyone for a world-class project. This is indeed a very happy moment. Congratulations to Sarawak Energy and Three Gorges on the set and timely implementation of this very important project to build Sarawak's 944 megawatt Morun HP. The construction of Morun HP contributes further to the Sarawak's score agenda to attract energy intensive industries to the state that will drive Sarawak's economy and standard of living to status in the shortest possible time. Murum is designed to be the most efficient and environmentally sustainable hydropower plant. It was constructed and completed in only five to six years by a team of over 2,500 people. Murum是中国三峡集团在海外的第一个 总承包项目，我们按照人与自然和谐的这样一个理念来设计这个大坝，主要就是保护了这个大坝左岸和右岸的这样一个圣石。那么目前我们看到这个大坝呢，这个两岸的圣石屹立和这个大坝呢能够完
dam rum ini uh, macam beri manfaat kepada masyarakat Penan uh, di mana mereka dapat pergi kerja kemajuan sikit lah saya harap masyarakat Penan ini lebih uh, berusaha lebih maju ke hadapan dan juga anak-anak sekolah saya mau seluruh anak masyarakat Penan yang terlibat dam rum rajin ke sekolah uh, kita tak tahu nasib uh, mereka dapat pendidikan yang lebih tinggi uh, mereka juga Uh, senang uh, berjaya dalam hidup mereka. First of all, I would like to congratulate and also to thank CCB, not only developing the hydroelectric dam, but also are doing their very best to educate the Penan kid. And CCB is also giving incentives for Penan student that attend classes. This is very good start for the Penan education being undertaken by SEB. Through community engagements, concerns were considered and addressed. For example, the dam crest was purposely rerouted to preserve Batu Tunggun, a rock formation sacred to the Penan people. And Sarawak Energy continues to support them with dynamic and effective CSR activities focused on education and young people, such as the award-winning Murum Penan Literacy Program, and more recently, the setting up of a Penan Education Fund under the Belaga Charitable Trust. So Energy has introduced development programs to enhance skill and knowledge among the communities, such as introducing new and contemporary handicraft design to cater for a more globalized market. Currently, Astra Energy purchases many of the indigenous handicraft from the Murum community and uses this for our corporate gift. Saya mewakili uh, penduduk di kawasan Murum ini ingin mengucapkan terima kasih kepada kerajaan negeri Sarawak karena telah membawa transformasi di uh, kawasan Murum ini Dan empangan ini bagi saya membawa banyak perubahan pembangunan kepada kawasan pedalaman, terutamanya di kawasan Tegulang dan juga di Metalun. Resettled into their new homes, the community can still choose to practice their traditional lifestyle of hunting in the forests or transition into new sedentary farming. Through the Murum Tagang system, indigenous fish species are protected, restored and managed, and the rivers are conserved and enriched, providing reliable and sustainable food source for the communities. Sustainable considerations include a special ecological power station that supplies the resettlement areas and also preserves and keeps alive a 13-kilometer riverine ecosystem used by local communities. Through the Waimo Initiative, thousands of animals have been rescued and safely relocated, and plant species have been cultivated and replanted along the lake shore. The gazetting of the catchment area and perimeter rainforests help to ensure the environmental security of the surrounding tropical ecosystem. The entire project was designed and constructed according to the guidelines of ICOLD, the International Commission on Large Dams, and the International Hydropower Association's Hydropower Sustainability Assessment Protocol. Independent dam safety experts and seismological experts reviewed the construction of the project at every stage and hundreds of accurate electronic sensors continuously monitor the dam's safety and stability. Murum Hydroelectric Plant brings many benefits to Sarawak and its people. The abundant, affordable and renewable energy will help to develop the state through the Sarawak Corridor of Renewable Energy. SCORE Phase 1 saw the signing of agreements with major inward investors, bringing well-paid jobs and transferring skills and technology. I wish to congratulate uh, Sarawak Energy Brahat for job well done. In 2015, we have uh, completed and commissioned uh, Murum Adulty Power to up about 944 megawatt. They are able to give affordable energy for the industrial player to have a better investment venue in Sarawak. 
The project itself reduces Sarawak's environmental footprint by minimizing the need to burn millions of tons of fossil fuels. And by lowering generation costs, the plant also helps to stabilize and lower energy prices for consumers. The reservoir and its surroundings offer potential commercial opportunities in aquaculture, ecotourism and adventure tourism. And the successful resettlement projects will help vulnerable indigenous communities to have a greater share in the continued prosperity of Sarawak.